learned that everything in the world has a body and has a soul. And uh, also the Torah has a body and has a soul. And the body of the Torah is talking about all of our, all of our outer spiritual work. How does a person keep kosher? How does a person keep Shabbat? You know, how do you put a mezuzah on your door? How do you make a blessing? All the, the details of the halachot, of the Jewish law, this is, the, this is the, the body of the Torah. It's very, very important. It's like the body of the Torah, right? The, the Kabbalah is the, is the soul of the Torah. The Kabbalah is, all the, is the teachings of what is our intention, what is the inner spiritual transformation we're trying to work through through, out of, through, through this outer spiritual work. We, uh, both of them are important. The body is important. The soul is important. They're both very, very important. You can't have one without the other. But, uh, but the soul is more important. So we learn that the, the purpose of the, of the, of the body is, is to serve the soul. So we learned that uh, all of the Torah learning is very, very important. But we learned that uh, however amount of time a person dedicates to, to learning Torah, if a person has one hour a day to learn, we learn it's important for a person to learn at least then 30 minutes and one second the inner aspects of Torah. Because we always want to give more importance to the, to the soul than the body. So we, so we learned that as much time as a person has to, to do spiritual learning, the idea we learn is to spend a little bit more time, you know, at least, you know, a little bit more time than half learning the inner aspects. Because uh, in some way, the whole, we learn that the whole world, universe, is set up with this balance between body and soul. And on some level, the body roots into the desire to receive, and the soul roots into the desire to give. And the whole transformation, we want to give more importance to the, to the desire to give. And we actually learn from the holy books, from the, from the Zohar and the books of the Kabbalah, that uh, it's not just a like, nice idea, but we learn that the whole, the, the nation of Israel giving importance to the inner aspects of the Torah, meaning the Kabbalah, meaning the aspects of the Torah that are dealing with consciousness and this transformation of consciousness towards truly caring for the other is, um, is, is part of the whole transformation of, of world consciousness. You know, the, the Torah is, is you know, the most powerful energy in the world. And when the nation of Israel is putting more of their energy of learning of the Torah into the outer aspects of the Torah, so it's sending out the energy into the world that the, that the body is more important than the soul, that the outer aspects are more important than the inner aspects. And when the nation of Israel is giving more energy to the inner aspects of the Torah, the aspects of the Torah that are talking about consciousness, so then the energy that's being given out to the world from the nation of Israel is the energy that, the, that the, our, our inner transformation is, is so important. And uh, you, know, you talk about our time and the learning of the Kabbalah, we, we learn that you know, if a person is, you know, is, is a little bit sick, so a person could go to any doctor and they'll get better. You know? if, uh, if chas v'shalom, a person is very, very sick, so a person needs to go to very, very good doctor with you know, very strong medicine. And uh, if we look at, if we, we learn that you know, in order to get to the next stage of, of what we're going through in the world, we have to reach the place where everybody in this entire world is like one family, truly caring for others as they care for themselves. And then we get to the next levels and the next levels. So if that's like where we need to get to in this world, so the world right now isn't just like a little bit sick, we're like in the intensive care unit. <laughs> right? we have, we have with something like 24,000 people a day dying of starvation every single day after day after day. Yeah, we spend more money on the military than we spend on anything else. We're, the world's in the intensive care unit when we realize this. And uh, so we learned that right now we need like the strongest, strongest like medicine. And uh, the te inner teachings of the Kabbalah is is, it's like the strongest like medicine that the whole subject matter is how to truly care for one another. That's the subject. That's the, that's the teaching. When we have this in the world and we look around and see what we're going through and where we need to get to, so we see how important it is to, to be learning these things.